Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Julie and I am the Never Designer behind Twin Stitches Designs. Today I am so excited to be coming to you guys with another oh so basic collection. This time we are featuring a men's collection. This is something that I haven't done before but has been in the works for a while and I'm just so excited to share all the details with you. I'm going to be sharing how to get early access, coupon codes, and when I mean early access, I mean a full day early access, which, I mean, how amazing is that? So grab your beverage of choice and grab your knitting and let's get going. First up, um, this collection is all featuring Knit Picks yarns. I absolutely adore Knit Picks and I just want to thank my friends over at Knit Picks for sending this yarn to me. You can find everything I talk about down below this video, um, the links to the yarn, those are my affiliate links. That means that at no extra cost to you, I earn a commission if you purchase through them. So I appreciate every single one of you who always purchases through my links. Now let's get to what you're really here for is the patterns. This collection has three full patterns. It includes all the instructions for the top down knitting using magic loop. Now, if you like a different type of knitting, you are more than welcome to use any method you like, nine inch DPNs, two circulars. Um, the instructions are for all three patterns are written and charted. It has a heel flap and gusset, and I'm working on a PDF that will include um, hopefully a short row heel, heel flap and gusset, as well as a afterthought heel. So depending on the type of heel, it might be included later um, if I can't get it done for the release. Now, all three patterns are gonna be in a collection. You can't purchase them separately. You will be able to purchase them all together for $9 Canadian. Uh, it's the exact same thing as my last club, my last Oh So Basic. Just because I want this as affordable for everybody, I want these patterns to be accessible to others. So if you want a coupon code early access, click down below for my newsletter sign up. You guys will get it tomorrow, which is July 8th on Thursday. Now let's dive right into the patterns. Like I mentioned, I have three different patterns in this collection. The first up is Grandpa's Sweater Socks. Um, I was chatting with my friend Laura and we both said the patterning on this reminds me of like a grandpa sweater, or grandpa's cardigan, that classic, classic look. This was designed out of Knit Picks Stroll Tweed in the Flagstone Heather colorway. I absolutely love um, all of the Knit Picks Stroll in Stroll Tweed, which is the yarn that I've used. I will link um, th those links down below. All of the patterns were designed with a 2.25 millimeter needle, top down, as I mentioned, heel flap and gusset, which I find is a perfect fitting heel for me. But you are more than welcome to use whatever type of heel um, you rather in your socks. So this pattern creates the squishiest fabric and believe it or not, is only knit pearl textures. I wanted also each pattern in this collection to feature simple stitches because when you're knitting for men, their feet tend to be a little bit bigger. Um, so you want something that's kind of really nice, intuitive, memorizable, and that's what this collection is all featuring. All patterns are memorizable. Um, all patterns are easy and simple and use very little stitches. So this one is one of my favorite. I absolutely love it. I love the tweed. I find the tweed um, just creates that classic look. So this is going to be the first pattern in the collection. Let me know down below as well which one is your favorite, which one are you going to cast on, who are you knitting for. Now this is geared towards men, but you don't have to knit it for men. You can knit them for yourself. I mean, odds are, you guys, I want a pair of these grandpa socks for myself probably out of like the lavender fields. I'll put a photo here of that purple tweed. Love, love them from Knit Picks. Now the second pair of socks, um, I've named them my Wall Street socks. These remind me of like a businessman, somebody who wants a nice pair of socks. They look like a business suit and tie. They look like someone who's like, I don't know. I just find they look professional. They look crisp and somebody you know has a suit and then they want a nice pair of socks to go with it love it so this one was designed out of knit picks stroll in rainforest 
Heather. I absolutely love this color. It is a beautiful blue and just absolutely stunning. It also only has two stitches um, for this. So really simple. Absolutely love it. And the way that the stitches happen in right here where the seam is, I actually really love it because it makes me feel like these were like real commercial socks and don't really look like knitted socks. So they only have that on the sides and I kind of really enjoy that, that look and feel to it. This one again is knit top down with a heel flap and gusset. And I just really love these. I think um, my husband is going to live in all of these socks. Really love it. Um, knit pick stroll and stroll tweed if you are wondering we're absolutely amazing i've made socks in them in the past i've made sweaters they are a affordable and durable sock yarn love 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 it and i'll also be showing at the end some other um, colorways that knit picks offers in those that i have in my stash now the last sock is a little hard to see without a sock blocker but it is so beautiful now this one i called classic with a twist because there's little twist of cables and i just absolutely love how classic it looks now this one can be for somebody who's just i don't know it makes me feel like a log cabin um somebody who's going away for the weekend or even somebody who's just i don't know it reminds me just of like that log cabin cozy feeling um so obviously I have both socks right here um it is knit out of Knit Pick Stroll in Reindeer Heather, Stroll Tweed, excuse me. And it has just these small little cables, which is very simple, don't worry. Um, and just kind of a ribbing to bring it all in really helps with that texture. Again, top down, heel flap and gusset. Absolutely love all of these socks. Um, just really enjoy it, super simple pattern. Uh, my, my testers really loved all three of these patterns. I did. I did end up um, getting test knitters for them just for you to see the different colors and combinations and things. People use some different heel, um, like a contrast heels and toes. Some people did a, like a fun toe. You can really have fun with this collection. Do, you know, socks for anyone. It doesn't have to be towards men, but I just kind of wanted a unisex collection. So now you might be wondering what the other colors that I have. And I have an amazing bag over here to share some of these colors with you. Now this one is one of my favorites. It is Stroll Tweed in North Sea Heather. Oh, absolutely love this blue. Really love this one. Uh, this one too. Oh, I need to make a pair of socks up. This one is Stroll Tweed in Marine Heather. Now each of these, yes, they are small, uh, 50 gram balls. You need two of these for one pair of socks because they are 231 yards per 50 grams. So you definitely need two and the same goes for the, the stroll. Um, if you want just like a nice neutral gray, cobblestone heather in stroll is beautiful. I love, love, love this gray. I think it's a nice staple gray. Um, it's kind of like the flagstone heather, but without the tweet. Um, yes, so this is the flagstone Heather in the tweed, which I designed the grandpa's um, sweater socks. All of these yarns are machine washable, which is great, especially if you're gift knitting to anyone um, and you want them to have durable socks. Stroll tweed in Earl Grey Heather. It has a nice light blue, light gray feel, really unisex. I love, love this color. Um, I also have Prusian Heather, which I have knit myself a sweater out of, and I'm also making my husband a sweater out of this color. You might be hearing the girls in the background. They're watching Baby Shark. <laughs> I'm sure many people can attest to, to having Baby Shark in their house. Um, and the next color I have is Stroll in Aurora Heather, which... This green, I swear, the website does not do it justice. It is incredible in person. I love, love this green. Now, you might be wanting to do some colors for fall, so I decided to pull a few other. Um, this one is Persimmon Heather. I think I'm doing that right. It's a beautiful tweed, but in like an orange. It's not really super orange, so I think that it could appeal to a lot of different people. I 
need a pair of socks in this. It is beautiful. It's the most beautiful heathery orange. And then if you're really looking for something that is fall pumpkin, then you need to grab pumpkin in stroll. This is perfect for those fall um, socks and you can really get beautiful texture out of these. And the last two that I grabbed, this one is Bamboo Heather, as well another beautiful green in the stroll. Love, love all of those heathery look to it. And the last one, if you're looking for more of a woman's um, pink, my favorite pink of stroll is Dogwood Heather. I think that this one is just beautiful and really love, love this color. Now, obviously that's not all of the Nipix Stroll and Stroll Tweed. Uh, I just wanted to pull a few of the colors just to show you how they look in person and how amazing that they are. You don't need to use Nitpick Stroll and Stroll Tweed for the yarns. You can use any yarn that you have on hand, some stash, you can even use minis, whatever you like. Make these socks your own. Have fun with it and I hope that you enjoy the collection. I'm gonna be coming out with another oh so basic um, collection that will probably be coming into mid to late August, which I'm super excited about as well. So if you have any questions on the collection, let me know down below. Also let me know which one you are looking forward to, um, which one you're gonna be wanting to cast on right away. And don't forget to subscribe to my newsletter. You'll get a coupon code and early access. So thank you so much, you guys. Make sure you like and subscribe as well to this video. It just lets me know what type of content that you guys love and um, more so I can give those more to you guys. As always, everyone, happy knitting and until next time.